Hey everyone, Brad from BD Diesel here, coming to you from the newly revised transmission shop floor. We've made some exciting changes and I'd love to show you around. The first step in our process is our core staging area. All the cores come in from our graveyard. They're married up with the work order at this point where we know the sales order, the customer requests, um, and what parts are required to reassemble. As they move through our teardown process, all the parts are graded and get prepped for wash. After teardown, they move into our aqueous parts washer where all the parts and case are cleaned, all oil is broken down, all clutch debris, and any dirt from the cases is completely removed. So we make sure that we have clean parts on assembly. After the transmission comes out of the wash tank, the valve body is delivered to our valve body department where the valve body is completely disassembled, cleaned, graded, new solenoids married up with them, and they are running our valve body tester to make sure that they're in good working order. This is all the raw cases that have come out and uh, are ready for grading and painting, bolt extraction. What we've really focused on in our new system is uh, having parts ready for each process. This stops uh, downtime uh, and increases efficiency and just creates overall better visibility on what's coming up next and what the builders and the next step in the process can expect. After the transmission leaves the paint area, it comes over to our staging area over here where we have a rack of good used graded hard parts uh, that we can supplement into a transmission that may have some damaged parts, whether it be planetaries, drums, cases if need be, pumps. Everything in this area is painted, graded, work order with it and ready to go and ready to be fed into the build area. Once again, uh, staging is important focus on this shift as it allows us to pivot based on customer demand and uh, create better visibility of what the builders uh, are gonna be working on next. One of the biggest changes we've made is more space for our builders. Uh, in our current layout now, we have room for six builders to work comfortably, all with their individual tool stations. And there is also room to incorporate new builders into a training slash building process. This new shift has uh, eliminated congestion and just allowed the builders to have more space to, to work comfortably. Once the transmission assembly is complete, we move over to our dyno stage, uh, where we always have units ready to go onto the dyno to make sure that this machine never stops. Um, here we have a 68 and a 48 that is bolted up to the dyno, uh, ready to be tested. During our test procedure, we look for uh, any noises, vibrations, making sure that all pressures are good, that be uh, throttle pressure on the current model we have up there, the 48, uh, mainline pressure, reverse pressure, cooler pressure, uh, lockup apply pressure, um, and just make sure that it's got a clean bill of health before it leaves the door. Once the dyno test is complete, the transmission is packaged into one of our black coffins or totes or put on a shipping pallet and gets packaged up with any accessories that may be going out the door with it. They leave the department right into the shipping area. The motivation behind all these changes is to better serve our customers and to increase efficiency, diminish lead times, and to increase overall quality. Check out our entire transmission line at bddiesel.com.